What's up and good afternoon guys. Welcome back to another video. Today I'm doing another update video for you. So stay tuned and we'll be right back right after this. Okay, real quick guys before we get started in this video. I've been looking at my analytics and I noticed about 96 to 97 percent of you aren't subscribed. So what I'd like you to do, take a few seconds, scroll down just a little bit and hit that little subscribe button right there and then the little bell notification icon and set that to all notifications for me. Then after that, if you will, hit the little like button and then hit the share button and share this video out with everybody that you know. Share it out with your friends, your family and anybody else trying to build this channel we're trying to make it a great channel for everybody to enjoy so if you will just take a few seconds and do that for me and I appreciate it it really helps the channel out and uh, by hitting that like and subscribe button and then getting the notifications set you get to see any time that I got a new video that drops and comes out so if you will just take a few seconds and do that for me and I appreciate it thanks guys now on to the video okay guys we're back we're back we're back so as you remember, we got this little titanium knife that we bought that has the little um, glow-in-the-dark uh, tubes in it on uh, both sides, here and here. Well, I want to tell you guys, I have been testing this knife out and using it, and I want to tell you, do not, I repeat, do not buy this knife. It's that little titanium knife that I put a link to in my description on the video so what I'll do is um, up here in the, the left hand corner up here I'll put a uh, a uh, or actually maybe it's over here I don't know anyway it's gonna be up here somewhere it's gonna be a, a link to the video that I made of this little knife and uh, anyway I just want to say that I'm doing this little update because this knife is extremely extremely dangerous um, so I got this knife out and started using it and uh, ran into some trouble with it. Um, it may not look like I've used it, but I really have. But here's where the problem lies, right here. This little um, frame lock right here. What happened was, is on the inside in here, this frame lock moved to the other side of the knife on the, the blade. And while I was using this knife, this blade here completely folded backwards on me. Um, so that is extremely dangerous. Um, and if I had been like using it the other way to, to like scrape something or, or do something like that, it could have folded in and come in here and cut my hand. So um, anyway, there's going to be a link uh, up here on one of these two sides here. Um, so just be aware, um, get a different knife. Do not buy this one. Like I said, I've got a link to it. Um, it was in my last video that I did. Um, yeah, it's a great looking little knife. It's pretty cool. Um, it's got these little glow in the dark tubes and whatnot, but this knife is extremely, extremely dangerous and I do not recommend anyone buying it. Uh, like I said, the little um, frame lock here moved past it on the other side, and this blade folded backwards. Now, say I'd been, you know, uh, scraping my ferro rod or something like that, and it had done that, and it moved over and got past it, and this thing folded in on my hand. Um, yeah, it could have cut me pretty good. So, um, I do not recommend buying this knife at all. Not at all. Like, this knife is stupid sharp still, but, um, let me get it over here, see if maybe you can, there it is. It's the Olatans titanium knife, made by Olatans. So... Anyway, guys, I just wanted to put this out there as a PSA. Um, 
this frame lock here does not work it will not hold the blade uh, putting any kind of force on it like and I had some pretty good force on that that liner lock when I was using it and because um, the way I'm, I have to hold it and uh, when I did I was pushing on it and that whole blade just just completely folded backwards on me so anyway uh, this is the Olatan's titanium knife do not do not buy this knife under any circumstance um, I'm going to take and write Olatans and send them a letter and uh, show them the video that I did of it. I'm not going to put this video up um, just because, like I said, it was a safety thing and I'm, I'm just not going to do it. So, um, anyway, I'm going to send them the pictures and video that I took of it completely unfolded and show them what happened to it. Um, there's got to be a different way to do this. Maybe they can put in a liner lock instead of the frame lock on this one. Um, I don't know, but anyway, this knife is stupid unsafe, and I do not recommend anyone ever buying this thing. So, anyway, that's the Olatan's Titanium Knife. Uh, like I said, I just want to make this quick update and put this out there for you guys. So, anyway, thank y'all for joining me. We'll see y'all next time, and until next time, I've been Red Fox with Red Fox Outdoors.